Take a pencil and found them! Sorry, guys, we have nowhere to leave. Help us, please. It's our duty as crafters, Sue. Mm -hmm. Agreed. Let's build them a house. Yay! <laughs> this is gonna be the base for our house. Uh, it looks kinda small, Sue. Don't you think so? Don't worry, Sammy. We'll have two floors and five rooms. Uh -huh. Unbelievable! Okay, each room will have its own color. The green room. Then we'll have a yellow one. This room will be purple, and the walls in the next one will be pink. Wow! That's a totally new approach. Me like it! <laughs> Thank you! Uh, Sue, where are you? I can't see you! Mm -hmm. Ah, I found the second floor. Well done, Sammy. Just what I needed. I think this is great. And what do you say? Nice! Oh, I'm so tired. Gotcha! Mm -hmm. I know what room we'll do first. Me too. Let's deal with the bedroom. I know my Melody adores the color pink. She has a great taste. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. This is going to be a cozy pink bed for my Melody. Voila! Looks neat and soft, right? I'll place it here by the window. This room looks so good! Hmm, maybe I should swap with my Melody. I'm afraid this might not be soft enough. Sam, would you be so kind? Call me Mr. Samuel, dear. Mm -hmm. What did you need? My ears have become too old. Hey! Oh, no respect to the elderly. <laughs> That's a good one, Sammy. But this is perfect stuffing for the bed. Now my Melody is going to have the sweetest dreams on the softest mattress of all. I'll add some decorations to make this tiny bedding even cuter. We definitely need to swap our bedrooms. Hey, <laughs> it's not yours. Whatever. Here we go. Hmm. We definitely need a headboard. Uh, I've got an idea how to make the headboard, Sue. Watch me. Tell me it's the cutest headboard you've ever seen. Wow, it is, Sammy. And it's so creative. Here we go. And one more piece. Wow, this bed looks so jumpable. Yahoo! This is so awesome! <laughs> a bed is not a trampoline. It's very dangerous jumping on it. Yeah, yeah, I get it now. No jumping on the bed. Keep that in mind, friends. If you jump on the bed, you can fall and really hurt yourself. Let's keep going. This is a nightstand. Nuh-uh, Sue. It should be as pretty as the rest of the room. Hmm. You are right, Sammy. My bed. But I will fix it. Ta-da! Now that's much better. Did we forget about anything else? Duh. What if my Melody wants to read in bed? All right. And I'll also put some curtains on the window to make it look even cozier. Okay, this room is complete. Let's move on. Interesting. I'm sure Sue has a different shoe size. So huh? tell you. Oh, got it. One sec. Mm -hmm. Um, Sue, mm -hmm. we need to make a bathroom next. Huh? <clears throat> and we better hurry. Oh, got it. Let's get down to work. Look what I found, Sue. It'll make a great bathtub. Thank you, Sammy. You've got such a creative mind, really. You know, you could probably make a career as an interior designer. What do you think of this, maestro? It is actually quite good, Susie. <laughs> Little details always make grand change. Remember that. No bathroom is complete without a shower, right? Here we go! Sue! The bathtub is awesome! Oh, hey! There's water on the bathroom floor, Sammy! It's dangerous! You'd better not splash! But why? <laughs> Ouch! If the floor gets wet, you can slip, fall down, and might even hurt yourself! Okay, I get it now! Fellas, remember! No running and splashing in the bathroom! If the floor is wet, it's slippery! So, always be careful and wipe off spilled water! This will be a mirror perfectly fit for our cinema roll style. Well, how about some magic time? Bibbidi bobbidi subscribity! That's how it's done. 
Great job, Sammy. Mirror, mirror on the wall. <laughs> oh, awesome! Cinnamarol is gonna be so happy! Whoops, hurry up, Sue. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Uh, I'm doing my best, Sammy. Oh, there. One final detail. A pretty bath mat to keep your bare feet warm, you know? <sighs> this feels so good. Sue, have you ever heard that slimes are actually fearless? Oh, really? Got any proof? Of course! I remember one time… <gasps> oh, my tibidaba! What's that, Sue? Sounds like a monster! <laughs> <laughs> Relax, my fearless friend. It's just one of our guests. Must be really hungry. That would be me. Sorry I scared you. Oh! We are gonna make a kitchen for you in no time! Psst. But for now, can I interest you with candy? Sam, business before pleasure. I need some green clay, please. Coming right up! A few more touches and it's ready! Great! I'll use this clay to cover the kitchen counter. It will look really stylish. Do you think such doors will suit our counter, Sue? Wow, so cute! I know! And I really like this color combination. I'll add two more doors to this side. Looks amazing! The countertop is going to be marble, so I won't mix blue and white clay completely, you know? Uh-huh, that's enough! Now we can cover the countertop with it. Here we go! Nice! That's just what I was talking about! Now let's put the whole thing together. And since we've got a sink, we need a tap too. Voila! Everything's ready! What else do we need here? Uh, Sue, help! It's too heavy for my slimy muscles! A toaster! Oh, it's so cute! Great job, Sammy! And here's a cooker, of course! Um, Sue, Karapi is really hungry! Huh? Sue? Where is she? Well, I can cook a meal myself. What's the big deal, right? <laughs> What's going on here, <laughs> Sam? Hey! I've just started! Why did you interrupt? No cooking without the adult supervision, Sam. It could be dangerous. Okay, okay, Sue. I'm sorry. I will never ever cook on my own. Well, you promised. Now, what do we need to keep food from going bad? I know, I know, a fridge! But I must tell you, it's not the best place for hiding or living. <laughs> That's right! The fridge is for keeping food only, not for playing or anything. But without a door, the cold will escape and the food will go bad! Right! Thank you, Sammy! And it's an awesome fridge door! And the final touch… Hey! It reminds me of someone! <laughs> now it's time to make a room for Kitty White! I'll draw the outline first. Can you guess what this is going to be? Uh, I'll tell you! A TV stand! Just wait and you'll see! Cute, isn't it? Did someone say TV? If it's bigger than mine, I'm ready to swap! <laughs> I'm just kidding! Don't worry, it's not bigger than yours! Hey, wait! Do you mean this is my TV? Yep, I took it away! Watching too much TV is bad for your eyes anyway! Alrighty, we'd better start making the headboard for our future sofa! This white clay is perfect for it! Sammy, help me decorate this, please! That? I can do, Susie! It will be ready in no time! Ouch! No worries! I'm fine! Everything's okay! All done! How'd you like it? It's perfect, Sammy! Hail, Tibidaba! Aw, oh, I really like how it turned out! Our sofa is almost ready, friends! See? Now, this piece goes over here, this way! Oh, we nearly forgot about the legs! That's better! And it goes right in front of the TV! Mmm, feels good, Sue! Wait, Sammy! What are you doing? Watching TV! Why? Don't sit too close to the TV! It's really bad for your eyesight! <gasps> what if it's too late? I've always been sitting too close to the TV! It's okay, Sammy! Just don't do it anymore, and you'll be fine! <laughs> wow, thank you! It's the best room in the house! Where was it? Huh? Hmm. What? Really? You aren't kidding? Okay. I hate to break it to you, but Kurami says she really needs a big closet. No problem. It's easy to make. Really? Cool! 
sparkly beads will make perfect legs. Here we go. We also need a vanity mirror. What a handsome slime! Hey, Sue, give it back! Sorry, but this is a perfect fit for our craft. Okay, now let's start making a closet. It's gonna be purple. Kuromi likes this color. Oh, it's so spacious, right? And here's a perfect place for it. I must admit, it does look cute, Sue. Huh? Huh? Ah, what was that? Do you hear it too? Hey, were you playing hide and seek in there? <laughs> you never hide in closets or cupboards. It's dangerous. You might not be able to get out. Got it. We need to follow home safety rules. That's right. Okay, you can move in, guys. with a ball at home. Yeah, did you already forget what happened yesterday? Who's playing ball at home? Stop this instant! There, there. That's why you should play ball games outside only. <laughs> right! Safety comes first. Awesome! Friends, if you follow these safety rules too, give this video a like. And remember to subscribe to our channel. See you soon. Bye! Made in a classic Tibetan style from the early doll century. Check this out! There's a private pond on the property. No, this one is too boring. And smells like fish! This is already the tenth house I'm showing you! What do you want? I want our house to be luxurious, with lots of golden bright colors. Oh, and a swimming pool! A swimming pool? Where am I going to find that? <laughs> Sue! I'm desperate! Don't worry, Sammy. I'll help you. Girls, are you okay with that? Totally. Just don't forget about the pool. Great. Then let's start the construction. First of all, our house needs walls. <laughs> Otherwise, it wouldn't be a house, right? Let's put these together. Okay. Where does this belong? Hmm. Oh, I got it. Hey! Where is all the furniture? On the pool! We're just getting started. Be patient, please. Tough client, huh? Ah, <sighs> they're too bossy. There is something else. I have brought the bathtub and it's super heavy. Help me! Got you. The dolls said they want lots of gold in their home. And I have just the right place to make the bathtub look unique. Oh, and to make it sturdier, we will add these golden legs. <sighs> Wait a second. Why I have only two here? Maybe I should become a hairdresser. I guess real estate is not my thing. Don't talk nonsense, Sammy. You are doing great. You are just not very lucky with the clients. <laughs> now we need a shower. I'm on it, Sue. I made it myself. Look. Looks awesome. Let's attach it right here. And also add this cute little tap. I have some design ideas for the toilet as well. Oh, it is so heavy. What's wrong? Come on. What? I just wanted to test it. No big deal. Oh, no. You can't test it until we're finished here, okay? <sighs> All those dolls. Where was I? Right, the golden design. I will add another beautiful lace to the lower part. Uh -huh. Let's also decorate the lid with rhinestones. It truly looks luxurious. Oh, my feta. <laughs> looks like I won't have any quiet work time today. <laughs> Sorry, I just can't wait to move into our new house. Anyway, this wall goes here. And we can get to the kitchen. <sighs> I'm almost done with the fridge. Great. Then I will help you with the door.
I want to make a couple of notches to make it look like real fridge doors. We will also decorate them with some matching design. Cool! Now we need some handles so the dolls can open the fridge easily. Very well! And everything goes together like this. Our pretty fridge will stand over here. Hmm. We need to fill it with food though. Hey there! Food delivery! Thanks, Korea Sam. You are right on time. We will put all of it inside the fridge. Uh, do you think this shade of pink is bright enough for our dolls? I would say it's perfect. But still, we need to enhance it with some golden accents. Remember? The cabinet needs three doors. Voila! Let's glue them to the right place. Here. And we shouldn't forget about the handles as well. Ah, what a nice smell. Check out these beautiful flowers, Sue. Wow, they will be a perfect match for the kitchen cabinet. Uh, what? The handles? <sighs> okay, I will find something else. Sammy, try to find some yellow roses. I'm sure they will look great in our interior. And I will finish with the rest of it. For example, I will add a counter on top and attach this beautiful shiny tile to the wall. Looks awesome. Ooh, is it some kind of a bag? And the fridge is near. It's like a dream. You are wrong. It's the kitchen counter. You will cook here. Look, here's your stove. I'm so lucky. So, I found a meadow full of roses. Awesome, Sammy. Let's pick them. I have a great place for them in the kitchen. We will also add a basket with vegetables, so the dolls eat healthy. And our kitchen is ready. It's time to take care of the bedroom. To make a luxurious bed, we need a sturdy base. Maybe I can be a fashion designer. Look at my outfit. It's really cool, but I think it's not very comfortable. I guess you're right. But this lace can be a great addition to the special bed we are making. I really like how it's coming out. Hey, why the bed is so hard? Hmm. Because we didn't add the mattress yet. Now it should be soft enough. We need a headboard too. I guess this shape looks good. Let's get it out. I want to help. <laughs> cool, thank you. But let's make our headboard softer. So the dolls can sit comfortably if they want. More gold, more beads, more luxury. <laughs> okay, okay. The client is always right. Let's attach the beads all over the headboard. And even more. We'll add them at the edge too. This bed is so comfy. It makes me very sleepy. Oh, me too. One sheep, two. I can't do it. These pillows are too beautiful. That means they will look great in our dollhouse. <laughs> now, let's add a purple rug near the bed. And put a pair of slippers so our dolls don't freeze their feet in the morning. The bedroom is ready. Let's get to the swimming pool. The swimming pool seems too shallow. Hey, get out of there! We are still working! Our dolls wanted more bright colors in the house. So we'll make a rainbow design for the pool. The mirror will add even more colors to the water. And don't forget about the garage entrance. It should be neat and nice. Great! We also will decorate the hallway. I have some yellow beads left. Take them! Wow! We made such a beautiful panel! Let's hang it above the door. The floor will be white. Then the carpet should be red. I love this combination. I think this tall arch will be a great addition to our interior. The doors go here. Uh huh. We also have these cute handles for them. Oh, and we shouldn't forget about the roof, of course. It might rain any time. Let's add this pretty ornament in the doll's bedroom. Sammy, have a look! Oh, you are gonna love it! Would you just look at this? It's like a real red carpet! Uh-oh, I hope there are no paparazzi around. I don't wear makeup. Hey, look here! Wow, awesome! Sammy, don't get carried away. Okay, okay, I'll cut it out. I will start assembling the sofa from the back. First, let's make the upholstery. And add some golden decor, of course. I need the armrests. Ahem, Sammy! I just finished them, Sue. Here you go. You did awesome job. Thank you. Here go the cushions so it's more comfortable to sit. 
And of course, more decor. <laughs> oh, I want to add some beads on the back of the sofa too. I think we can add more glow to the couch. All right, Sammy. Here we go. Let's add more shine to it. Like this. Um, Sam, what are you doing? We are bringing you the table. Take it, girls. Go, go, go. Just a little more. Almost there. Oh, heavy. I'll take it from here. We'll put it near the sofa. It is so cozy. Best place for some tea. Say no more. Chef Sam is gonna take care of it. First, make a base from this beautiful green clay. Now, decorate it with some cool designs from white clay. Uh, you can do the rest. Right, Sue? Of course. Here, I will make a twisted line. And here goes a wave. And a net on the upper part. Now comes my favorite. Cherries on top. <laughs> mm, yummy. A great treat for the housewarming party. Now the last touches. We need the stairs, right? The car goes into the garage. And the water goes right into the pool. Great! Finally, we found our home! Yay! Hail, Tippy Dabba! The deal is closed! Hooray! Oh, what a beautiful morning! Oh, today I woke up on the right side of the bed! Ah, <laughs> oh, there is nothing better than a bubble bath to start the day! Wee! Oui. Good morning, Blondie! Did you sleep well? Oh, this sofa is so soft! <laughs> Glad to hear that! Am I hungry? No. Hey, let's better go swimming in the pool. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> hey there, by the pool. Did you forget that we have a party today? Oh, yes! Woohoo! <laughs> Yay! Hey, look here! Everyone, please say cheese! This is the best party ever! That's right! Wow, their pool is just awesome! This cake is so delicious! Oh. Mm -hmm. We did it, Sammy! I'm so happy! <laughs> Friends, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to give a thumbs up to that video! Bye! <laughs> One more photo! See you around! Yar! We won't let them get around us! Skipper, come on! Those guys are on to the teeth! Don't worry, we'll show them yet! Look out! <laughs> <laughs> you will remember this day when you almost defeated the captain! <laughs> yes! We will win! <laughs> What's going on here? Why is there such a mess everywhere? Sammy, I'm talking to you! <gasps> oh, Sammy, are you okay? Thanks, Sue! Everything is fine! <sighs> it's just all wrong! The mess, the pirates, the pirates! <laughs> Sue, Sue, where are you? I got it, Sue! <gasps> Why scare me so much? What did you get? I don't want to play pirates anymore. I want to help other toys that are in trouble. Let's open a toy hospital. Great idea, Sammy. But not now. Let's do it in the morning, okay? It's way too late now. Oh, right. I didn't think about that. Uh, let's go here like this. Uh -huh. Oh, there you are, Sue. Finally! Look what I came up with for our hospital! Great! Wait, did you stay up all night to make this drawing? Yes, yes, it doesn't matter. Let's get started! I like your attitude. First, let's prepare the perfect lawn as the base for our hospital. There you go. Uh-huh. Great! Now dump it all. Whoa, whoa! Careful! It's the most valuable cardboard straight from Tibidama! So, how about heading to the store for textures for decoration? Luckily, I'm good in construction. But I'm perfect in decor! Ooh la la! So many choices! There are textures for every taste! Oh, that's a pickle! I don't even know what to choose! Maybe this one or this one? Too many choices! Oh. Stay up, Sammy! Don't worry, I'll help you! Oh, merci! It is all just so exciting! How do you like this for the floor? Just what we need! And I'm thinking 
these to decorate the walls. And this one too. Um, we can start building the hospital. First, we need a garage. It's good that you thought of this right away. You don't say. Otherwise, we would be left without ambulances. I couldn't let that happen. So, everything seems to be okay here. But here it needs to be adjusted a little. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. How many more innocent toys will suffer if we don't build a hospital? We must prevent this at all costs. I agree. Ouch. So, let's get back to crafting. We'll start with the shelves. To store various medical devices. I'll glue the texture on both sides and make the edges look neat. I am here and ready to work! Hey, what are you doing? I'm taking this hammer away from you, mister! Calm down, Sue! Everything's under control! I just decided to help you to spit out the process! Thanks! But I won't return the hammer to you! Or you'll hurt yourself again! Oh, come on, look! It's all over now, and I feel great! Till, you've already had a lot of trouble in this episode! Mm -hmm. Consider it a vacation from hammers! Oh, well, what should I do then? You could help me with the next craft! It should be less dangerous! <laughs> Oops! Sorry, it was an accident, but at least the clay is soft, right? Any hospital should always have the best medicines, so the doctors could easily and quickly cure all patients. This goes here. We will also sign it, so no one confused it with something else. What about the rest, Sam? All is ready, you can take it! I found just the perfect place for them. Voila! Doctor, finally you're here! My son, Doctor, he refuses to eat broccoli! Mm. Everything looks fine to me. Are you completely sure that... <laughs> Why, my son? It should have been me in his place. <laughs> okay, okay. I'll take a closer look at him. So, I need tools to examine a patient. You got it, Doc. Just give me a minute. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. for the doctor. Check. Oh, thank you, nurse. Hmm. Now breathe. Don't breathe. Hmm. Everything is fine here, too. You know, I think that your son has a plain whimsy syndrome. What? Oh, no! How do we cure it? Dr. Sam has all you need in his portable first aid kit. It will be closed with a valve. Looks very cute. Let's add a handle for the most convenience. Here you go, Doc. Right about time. Thank you. And you? Please, would you just feed your son with something else? Wow, I didn't even think about that. Here's my professional opinion. Think less. Thanks, Doc. Bye. Well, if it's not broccoli, it's Brussels sprouts. <laughs> huh. Huh. Oh, it's not easy to help others. I'm even a little tired. By the way, did you write down their medical history? Yeah, look what a pile. I'll throw it right here. Wait, wait. This is a hospital. Everything needs to be kept in order here. Fine. We need to make special charts. Come on, join me, Sammy. Meh, forms. Okay, I'd do anything for the sake of the patients. Don't worry. It's fast and easy. Just repeat after me. I'm like this. You see? You are a great teacher, Sue. I did it in no time. Here. Now all the documents will be in one place. We also need a medicine cabinet with a door. Hey, but it's empty! This won't work! I have an idea! Now I will show you an amazing trick that I learned at the School of Merlin! What a great trick! Oh, hello and welcome to the Dr. Sam's office. Come, sit. <gasps> uh, uh, so, we have no chairs. Here, I've made the seat and you do the rest. Will do. Comfortable and beautiful. You definitely forgot about the laptop. How else will I register my patients? Did you mean how would you play video games during breaks? <laughs> you figured me out. But doctors also need rest. Duly noted. <laughs> okay, the desk is ready. You can invite the patient. There, there. Please have a seat. The doctor will be right up. Sorry for the long wait. So, what 
what did you come to me with today? Oh, I was just passing by. I'm fine. Whoa. Oh, so, you're not sick and you just came to go? Yeah, it's cool here. But it's like there's not enough decor. <laughs> Sue, don't you think our hospital is a bit boring? Let's decorate it. Sure. I think this is the best place for your doctor's diploma. We also need a bed for patients. We are a real hospital. I'll do the headboard and frame and you do the rest, okay? Coming right up. I will do everything in a blink of an eye. What do you say about this design? A hospital bed needs legs with wheels. That's right, Sammy. It is very important. <laughs> I will make this mattress the most comfortable and softest. It's a perfect fit. And let's not forget about safety. Oh, I would like to sleep on such a pillow. And this is the place for the patient's chart. There should be a vitamin drip, just in case. And the screen for the patients to feel comfortable if they stay overnight. Here go the scales to know the exact weight. And a wheelchair, in case some of our patients need it. It is time to set the entrance to the hospital. You are right. And I made a bright pink door with a very beautiful handle. Check this out. <laughs> Let me just secure everything so that it doesn't fall. We need to indicate that the hospital is open and welcomes everyone who needs our help. Okay, Sam, just don't mix up the letters. H comes first, L comes last. Alrighty, I'm done. Hop and hop. Look how beautiful the windows are. I also want to plant these pretty flowers. Okay, I think we're done. Uh, this is Dr. Sam. How can I help you? Oh, okay. I'm on my way. Sue, we have a new patient. He urgently needs our help. Come on, baby. What is it? Why can't you calm down? We need to examine him. Take off the blanket, Sue. Oh, no. What a severe inflammation. No wonder he cried so much. It's okay. We'll help you now, little buddy. There you go, sweetie. Sleep, little baby. You'll be fine. Yes, we did it! Friends, thanks for being with us. Don't forget to subscribe. And give a thumbs up, of course. See you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, everybody. Welcome to the show. Today we're cooking up something really fun. Wait, did you say cooking? This doesn't look like food. <laughs> it's not going to be for us, Sam. Come on, let's get started. We're going to make a kitchen first. Mom, are you calling that a rolling pin? A super Sam rolling pin. Patent pending. Okay, okay. Be careful, Sam, or you might get dizzy. Couldn't you say that earlier, Roger? I think I need to lie down. That sounds like a good idea. And I'll take care of this. Thanks. I just need the room to stop spinning. Poor Sam. I hope he's okay. Let's let him rest for a bit. And I've got some special clay here. It's got glitter in it. Awesome! We all need a little sparkle in our lives. Don't you think so, Sammy? What do I think? I think my spinning days are over. I don't believe it. I never thought this day would come. You're right, Roger. The world deserves to see me spin, spin, spin. That's the spirit. Now, this can go on top of the blue clay. I just need to line it up perfectly. There we go. Looks good. I'm going to make a water effect with this white clay. Wait, is this going to be an indoor pool? Awesome! No, it's going to be a kitchen sink, Sammy. Look closely! I better get my swimming gear. I'll be right back. He never listens to me. Okay, that's the first part of the kitchen, and it's ready. Now, I can wash some vegetables for dinner. Mmm, the strawberry looks nice and juicy. One strawberry isn't going to be enough. Let's have a crunchy carrot, too. I'm ready to make a splash. 
No, Sam, it's not real water. Don't do it. I can't resist. Cannonball! That was a great swim. I'm so confused. It's not a real sink. Well, so why was there so much water? It's one of life's little mysteries, Roger. What can you do? I guess you're right. Anyway, we've got a kitchen to finish. If we're making a meal here, we're going to need somewhere to cook it. It's like you read my mind. I'm already working on it. Oh, all that swimming of yours made me hungry. But unfortunately, this isn't going to be real food that we're making. It's a craft, remember? I mean, we can't eat modeling clay. What a shame, though. Uh, you're right. What a shame. <laughs> I'll make some food for us after we're done here, so don't worry. Wait! Where's my second ring of clay? It was right here. Woohoo! Round and round it goes. Oh, I should have known. Why don't you cut some silver triangles, Sam? Ah! I won't let you down. I'm ready for the triangles, Sam. Where are they? Call me, Count Sam! <laughs> it seems like this vampire needs to visit a dentist. This never happened to Dracula. It is so humiliating. It's okay, Sammy. You like too much garlic to be a vampire anyway. We need to be able to control the heat. So that we're able to cook the food. Now we shall cook the egg. I call this dish Eggs a la Samuel. It is, how do you say, ready. Um, but where are we going to put it? We need a plate. Don't worry, Roger. I'll take care of it too. How hard can it be? Here it goes. My way might be easier, Sammy. Don't you think? Whoa, look at it go! Uh, I think it's out of control! Be careful, you don't want to make a mess! Look out, the clay is airborne! Well, that's never coming back, so what are you doing, Roger? I'm making a decoration for the plate. Check this out. Pretty cool, huh? This blue will look great against the white of the plate. The plate? Sure. I'm just going to take a few pieces of it. Uh, what, what are you doing, Sammy? Nothing, nothing at all. Trust me. Trust you? <laughs> That's when I start to worry. I feel fabulous. The blue really brings out my pink complexion. Wow, who needs a salon when you've got modeling clay? Cool. It's time to start cooking. There's going to be some tasty food. We're going to make a juicy burger. I'll start with the bun. Did someone say burger? Burgers. I knew you'd hear that. You're just in time, Sammy. Let's see. Ah, the bun is nice and crispy. Very well. I'm impressed, Roger. You make it look so easy. Thanks, Sammy. I've been working on my cooking skills, you know. Okay, now we need to make the juicy patty. You should be grilling that, Roger. I'm a barbecue master. I was the best of the best in Tibby Dubba. Why do you always burn all the hot dogs, then? <laughs> How dare you, Raj? I am hurt and offended. Okay. If I need any tips, I'll definitely come to you. It's all under control. That's how I get the smoky flavor. This burger needs some cheese. How's it going over there? I gave up on my grilling career. There. There was an incident. That's okay. These things happen. You can help me with these burgers if you want. cheese has got some holes in it. It's like the mice have been eating it. <laughs> Luckily, there's no mice around here. Squeak, squeak. That's what Roger thinks. Squeak. You look good, Sammy. Although I guess now you should better look out for the neighbor's cat. Hmm, a nice tasty tomato. This burger is going to be huge. It's missing lettuce, but I'll fix that. Thanks, Sam. What would I do without you? Here, let me help you. It's a little tricky. It looks crunchy, Sam. I'm glad you were doing this. And our burger is ready! Whoa! I love it! I could eat it right now, but I must resist. We're going to create a whole banquet today. It'll be a feast for the ages! We will talk about it for generations. That's exactly what I'm going for! We should make some fruit! This is going to be a healthy meal! hope I get a nibble. Good idea, Sam. If you do that, I'll work on the fruit. 
Let's make the strawberry look more realistic. Now this is much better, but it needs a lot more. Mmm, a nice crunchy carrot is here. Yummy. A carrot? Ha, that's rabbit food. You know you have to eat your veggies to stay healthy. Ew. Anyway, I've almost finished the fruit. How's that fishing going? The fish are being stubborn, but I'm not giving up. Do you hear me, you fish? That's the spirit, Sam. Don't give up. My mouth is starting to water. This is going to be egg-sellant. Ha! Sam isn't the only one that can make jokes. I'm ready for the fish. <laughs> Sammy? <laughs> I guess I'll have to make the fish myself. Okay. That's much easier than fishing. Sam, wake up! You caught a huge fish! I did? I mean... I did, obviously! It was never in doubt, buddy. Wow! This all looks great, Roger! But there's nothing to drink! How about a cool glass of milk? Now we can finally relax. Not quite, Roger! I thought it would be a shame to waste all this food, so I invited some friends around for dinner. Oh, that's so nice of you. You're a good friend. But why are you wearing a suit? Well, I thought we'd be the waiters. I mean, we can't eat the clay food, can we? Then we better get started. We don't want our guests to be hungry. Here you go, Barbie. And this is for you, Mr. Teddy Bear. What? Do you like it? Here comes the food. We made a great kitchen. Subscribe to our channel if you like it. And see you soon. Sleek Slime Sam coming through. <laughs> I'm shredding this. Woo! What a great day, Barbie. It's the perfect day for a walk in the park. <laughs> beep, beep. Hey, that slime nearly hit us. So rude. But he's got some pretty sweet moves. <laughs> yeah, I've got some mad teeth. Whatever that means. Huh, anyone can do that. Give me that skateboard. Watch this. Oh, ha, oh, see, it isn't so hard. I'm a natural. Uh, maybe you should slow down. No, do a trick next. Check this. Ah, no, no! Ah, get me out of here! Oh, wow! He knows how to put on a show. Are you okay? Help is on its way. Oh no! Look at your arm. Uh, this looks really bad. We need to get you to the hospital. This isn't necessary, Barbie. I'm fine. Uh, you had a nasty fall. <clears throat> Can I help you? It's Ken. I think he broke his arm. I guess he needs skateboard lessons. <laughs> Doctor. Ooh, I heard someone needs my help. Come this way. Mm, this is so annoying. It'll be okay, Ken. My first ever victim. Uh, I mean, patient. Don't worry, you're in safe hands. I'll need to examine you. Um, hold still. I'll start with your temperature. Check this out. I use it to take the temperature of my pizza. Hmm, very interesting. Now I'll listen to your heart. But doctor, it's his arm. He fell off a skateboard, remember? It's okay, I know what I'm doing. I've been practicing on my teddy bears. <laughs> Not tickles. <laughs> hey, hold still. Knock it off, doctor. Hey, can you hear me? Doctor! <laughs> my ears! Why are you shouting? Shatter me! Hmm, maybe I should examine your ears. Okay, hold still. I really hope he cleaned his ears before this. There is only one way to find. Huh? Is that normal? I'll need to give you an injection. Here we go. Needle? Oh no. Barbie? Oh. Leave me be. Oh. Now I have two patients. What a day! This might hurt. Ouch! Actually, it will. Wait, was that the medicine or the super serum? Uh, meh. Are you okay, Barbie? I was so worried. <laughs> oh, Ken, you are here. I'll always look after you. Oh, uh, that's the sick bag. All right, these are for you, Barbie. Thanks, Dr. Sam. Um, what about me? Aha! Uh -huh. I'm glad you asked. You really hurt your arm. Oof. This x-ray looks really bad. I've never seen anything like it. But I have just the thing. These will help you feel better. 
Wow, thanks, Doc. Hmm, but we still have to fix that arm. It's the worst thing I've ever seen. Wait, what? <laughs> gotcha. I'm kidding. He just needs a band-aid, silly. <laughs> you were so scared. This won't take long. My work here is done. Now let's see what you owe me. Uh -huh. What do I owe you? What? This is my favorite part. Barbie! Oh, Karen, you look so much better. I'm never skateboarding again. I'll stick to skydiving. Come on, let's get out of here. There's the small matter of payment. Dr. Sam gave you the premium service. So you owe... Five thousand dollars? I don't believe it. Ooh. Fine, take the money. <laughs> I'm rich. Woohoo! I'm going on vacation. Gotta go. I've got a flight to catch. La, 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 la. So that was Sam's hospital. He can look after me when I'm sick. Oh, Sue, I need more medical supplies. I've got more patients waiting. <laughs> okay, Sam, you can count on me. I guess I'm Sam's new nurse. I'll need to flatten this modeling clay. I'll use this ruler to cut a piece off. Sam can deal with the patients. This is the fun part. Hmm, I'll need to round the edges. This is going to be a medical bag. Sam can hold all his equipment in it. Want to help, Sam? Crafting or patience? Hmm, crafting always wins. Nice work, Sammy. This can go on the bag. But I'm not done yet. Sam will need to carry the bag. So it's going to need straps. Wow, this looks so stylish. It would be the perfect accessory for a new dress. So help, I can't stop. Get this off me. <laughs> oh, I've never been silent for so long. <laughs> I was wondering why it was so quiet. There, the medical bag is finished. Just in time. One of my teddies has eaten too much honey. It's a sticky situation, you know? Oh no, I hope it's okay. I'm sure you'll look after it. I've lost my stethoscope. Can you make me one? Of course I can. A doctor needs a stethoscope. It's a vital piece of equipment. I'll just roll out this modeling clay. I could get used to this. That looks about right. Now I'll twist it like a pretzel. Did someone say pretzel? Anyway, Sue, I got this to show how much I care. Don't ask where it came from. Aw, that's so sweet, Sam. Hmm, I can definitely use this. It is so soft and squishy. I'm sure Sam won't mind. It's for his stethoscope after all. I know he's going to love it. And he'll be helping so many patients. No, medicine wasn't for me. So I became a pirate. Yeah, oh, oh. Really? Wow. Uh, it might have been a dream. <laughs> it sounds like quite the adventure. Your stethoscope is nearly finished. I just need to stick the pieces together. Oh, I almost forgot this part. That could have been embarrassing. Sam's hospital prides itself on its high standards. It's ready, Sammy. Come here. Perfect, Sue. It's just what I need. Look at it. Oh, no. I've got another patient. Life as a pirate was so much easier. I miss the open sea. <laughs> the patients will need medicine. And I know what to make next. Is it a cake? Are you going to make a cake? I'm so hungry. <laughs> no, it's not a cake. Mm, but that does sound good. You'll need something to make people feel better. So, I'll make you a syringe. But this one will be made from modeling clay. It looks good, but something's missing. <laughs> Aha! I know! You'll need the exact amount of medicine. So, I'll draw measurements on the side. You know, this is cute. What do you think, Sam? It's pointy, huh? Yeah, that's one large needle. Keep it away from me. Don't be scared. Dodge and move. Dodge and move. You're one quick bundle of slime. Stop it, Sue. I'm a serious medical professional. <laughs> okay, Sam. I suppose I better get back to work. Sam will need to examine the patients and make sure they don't have a fever. He'll need a thermometer to do that. I need to shape this modeling clay into a point. You know, being a nurse is fun. I get to help Sam and make crafts. This thermometer needs to be high-tech. 
So I'll add a digital display. Well, I'll use a pen, but Sam will never know. Sam, wanna test this out? Sure, but I'm a specimen of pink physical fitness. Scientists think I'm a medical marvel. Uh, I think you're ill. What? How? You gotta help me, Sue. It's okay, Sam. I'm right here. <laughs> And the Oscar goes to me! Nice acting! <laughs> but you're still ill! You'll need to take medicine! Nurse Sue's orders! They'll help you feel like your normal slime self! Here you go! Uh, huh? Hmm, I think I'd prefer a candy bar! I'm going to raid the fridge! <laughs> I'll be right back! <laughs> While Sam is having a snack, I'll finish making the medicine! I'll use pink and blue clay for this! Hmm, I think these are too big for medicine! I need to make them smaller. Then I'll need to cut them up. This is the perfect size. Dr. Sam will be helping all his patients. I'll join the pieces together. Hmm, we'll need a lot more than this. That's more like it. Sam! Oh, I'm feeling better. Turns out I was just hungry. Whoops, my patience! And I better make more equipment. I know what to do next! Dr. Sam is thorough in his examinations and he likes looking in ears! Although that seems pretty gross, it's got to be done! And this little gadget will do the job! I'll add the finishing touches to it! Now Sam can look in all the ears he wants! Come here, Sammy! I'll examine your ears! What the? No way! The only thing in there is slime! <laughs> That's okay, Sam. I believe you! I need to squash this clay! Oh, this feels good! That's just how I want it! This is going to be Sam's face mask! I don't want him catching any germs! I need it to be the perfect fit! Let's stack the pieces on top of each other! I want this to look like the real thing! I'll borrow Sam's nail brush for this part! Shh! Okay, where was I? This is looking great! But something is missing! Friends, any guess? It needs ear loops! There, that's more like it! Your face mask is finished, Sam! Just in time! One of my patients has been eating garlic! Yuck! I'm ready! <laughs> I'm glad you're not a vampire! So, there's one more thing that we need to make! Check this out! Lots of band-aids! We need to heal all those cuts and bruises! Especially if Ken decides to go skateboarding again! They look good, but I can make them better! Ah, <sighs> This has been a long day! I need band-aids! Stat! I'm really nailing this medical lingo! <laughs> I've got them right here! Thanks, Sue! You are the best! You always help me! Aw, oh, that's nice to hear, Sam! Let's go! Na, na, na. It's been another busy day in Sam's hospital! But thanks to all this, we healed every single patient! Great job! <laughs> I couldn't have done it without you, my friends! Thanks! And see ya! <laughs> <laughs>